Uh, we want to present to you uh, our framework called uh, THC that stands for Treasure Hunt Creator. That is a free and open source framework to build treasure hunt games. So what is a treasure hunt? A treasure hunt uh, is also called scavenger hunt. It's a game that you play in a physical space, like an office, a school, a building, or a, or a whole city eventually. And the game itself is built around the story. And the story is, is organized into levels. Each level contains a quest and a puzzle. The quest uh, reveals a part of the story and a hint on where to find the puzzle. And the puzzle contains a riddle that the player needs to solve in order to get the password to progress to the next level. PHC stands for Treasure Hunt Creator, and it's not the game itself, but instead is a set of tools that we developed in, uh, in the last month to create uh, decentralized treasure hunts. And we developed it on top of IPFS and, and Ethereum. So this is just a rough overview on how the system works. And as I told you, a game has different levels. Each level has a quest, a puzzle, and a password. And this structure that is nothing more than a tree, than a directory tree, is uh, put into THC that parses it, and then it outputs three things. Uh, it uploads on APFS all the encrypted levels of the, of the game. Uh, it also uploads on, uh, on Ethereum the smart contract that represents the game. And it uploads on APFS also the DAP. And I will show you in a second what I mean by that. Once deployed, the game is immutable. And uh, players, what they do basically is they use the DAP to read the story and to submit passwords. As I told you, the game is played in real life that uh, players use to basically uh, get into the players. Uh, a note that uh, it's important passwords are submitted to the smart contract and as some of us know the transactions are public in the Ethereum network, so we use zero knowledge proof to avoid replay attacks. I want to give you a short uh, overview of the game. So this is a screenshot of the DAP. We developed a game for the Chaos Communication Congress 2019. We had more than 200 players. And uh, this is basically the screenshot, screenshot from, the, from the smartphone. As you can see, this is chapter zero. All this content, content is loaded from IPFS and is decrypted using the password of the previous chapter. In this case, there was like an initial password to basically access chapter zero. Uh, then here you can see also a leaderboard. This data is pulled from the smart contract. And just to give you an idea on what a puzzle is and what I mean with a real life game, players had to, for example, for a specific chapter, chapter they had to find a box in this case, that was a cardboard box that was secured with a heavy lock, uh, with a heavy lock, and they had to open the lock to access the password to basically go to the next level. I will share at the end of this lightning talk also the blog post we wrote about the game. It's quite long, but we also collected a lot of interesting information about uh, the the game and how we develop the IPFS and the Ethereum part. Um, so basically, THC bridges IPFS and Ethereum, and uh, what we do that is quite nice, uh, we basically store in the smart contract the CID of all levels, so this makes, in a way, the game immutable, and this was also a problem that uh, someone else mentioned with the NFTs, and uh, everything is encrypted on IPFS, and we, and we use AES on the client to decrypt the data. So that's my lightning talk. Uh, and also get ready for a new quarantine compliant adventure by social distancing protocol. We rename ourselves to distancing from distortion. Uh, it's called 2121 information in our website, distortion with a zero.com, or you can follow us on Twitter here. That's all. Thank you. Um, <laughs> when do you expect to have the quarantine version out? The quarantine version? Uh, we are working right now on on uh, on the on the new store chapters. Usually, we have around 20 chapters, and you will be able to play the game uh, from home this time. But still, like some of the puzzles will be like in I don't know hidden in some websites or I don't know some in some webcams that you have to 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 find in the uh, on the internet and stuff like this. I guess that maybe a couple of weeks. We should be ready to go with 2121.